Alright, hey guys, it's Green Master, and welcome back to another video. Now, this is nothing special, this, I'm just reacting, I just want to give my opinions on the the new Hytale announcement trailer. So, if you guys don't know, the Hypixel server, so, uh, you know, I play Hypixel, and they've started, and they've started, like, a thing called Hypixel Studios, and they're in charge of developing this new game called Hytale. And I'm ex really excited to see what it's going to offer. I have not seen the trailer yet, to be honest. So, I figured, hmm, I'll do this, I'll record a video, since they did say we were, we were allowed to do this anyway. So, I guess let's get into it. And this is just two two minutes twenty two, so nothing too much we're gonna expect. And also, this is gonna be uncut, and uh, like pretty much uncut, unedited, just because it's just I'm just gonna be talking a lot in this video. So let's begin. So Hypixel Studios, like usual. Oh wow! Now wow. Oh, so first thing, so first things first. This is this is like Minecraft two point I mean, like, obviously the characters look slightly different, a bit more realistic, more textured that to them if you could say. The fires, but the scenery. If you look, if you look at it itself, it looks it looks quite. Oh wow! We could, you know, we could do that. Oh my! Messed up there. Now, as you can see, just in the air, just the, the fuse is very blocky. I mean, it's all mountains. This looks like something you do in Minecraft. The trees are somewhat similar, and the animations look better. Hopefully, assuming it'll be like that in the game. It looks very joyful. So these are the farms. So it's definitely more realistic. So we carry the wood, and you, of course your farms, like such. I mean, nothing crazy so far, but this looks fun to me. Like the graphics look different in Minecraft, so that's a plus. Like, yeah, this is definitely Minecraft 2.0. You can already see from here. You're just mining the wood, mining pickaxes in the caves, and crafting stuff. And wow. I mean, this texture. Th these textures are really, are really nice. Oh crap! Whoa, whoa. So that seems like an anvil. Looks similar to Minecraft, but not entirely. Particles on a fire, swords. I mean, good thing. Good thing is, it's this is what the game is probably gonna look like in general. I'm not 100% sure about that yet. But what I can say is, in Minecraft, you can't achieve anything like that just because you need mods for this. Everything there's literally just block, block, block. And okay, so cauldron, the furnace, there's stuff for cooking, and a chest. That looks like a very nice chest. It's probably like it's like a just a very village like game, village and adventure. From what I've seen in Ten Ember's video, yeah, he did say it was probably going to be something like an adventure video. And these views, I think they look pretty good. I mean, like, just, I mean, by looking at it from this angle, I mean, the people who make this trailer, of course, are going to try and make it look as nice as possible. And these characters are unique, too. I don't know what this is. It's probably what, I don't know what you call them. I don't want to sound, st like, stereotypical. Isn't that what those, like, those local tribes in the, in the Polynesian islands look like and such? In a way. I mean, it gives a really ha la large variety like that. And plus, this is unscripted as well, so this is just my, my first point reactions. And the tree leaves, um... Not Minecraft-like, which I mean, I shouldn't really be comparing this to Minecraft anyways, because this is an entirely different game. I'm, I'm just saying that some stuff really do look similar. So you have different biomes as usual, pretty nice. So the ice biome, now this is like the the Wild West kind of thing, and the grasslands. And I think this looks pretty nice, like there's a lot of canyons, the structures themselves are pretty unique. Oh, so these weapons and and monsters look pretty nice as well. So we got the bone arrows. Like this looks really realistic in general. And these bugs are, I say, they look creative. I mean, looks kind of like imagine a ladybug, but without but without the shell, and then it's like mute into a mutated form with more legs and such. That's what they look like to me. Then you can see like they look like bees up there, I believe. Yeah, those are definitely bees, and he's probably trying to fight them around here. I mean, like, the, the way that these characters look, they really fit the atmosphere. Oh, yeah, and I've um, already... And, well, I'm probably... Of course, as you can tell, I'm pausing this video a lot already, but this is just to give my reactions. I'm, I'm going to be talking over this a lot. Oh, wow. Yeah, so you could definitely build up your village and stuff, and, what, and from what we were seeing earlier... Wait, no, not here. Yeah, it is. The fighting animations look pretty cool as well. Just simple swing, swing, swing. Not just oof, oof, oof. Just, just single whacking.
castles. Ooh. So this is like those big bosses, I'm assuming. This is like those ice monsters. What do we call them? The yetis, I believe? Yeah. So, so this is a pretty nice view. I mean, this, I mean this, the graphics, especially on the sky, look nice as well. Like, mo look more modern, like the sun, the sunset. It's like this tropical island here. Ooh, there's even stuff underwater. I mean, the detail of the corals and for a game like this, looks pretty good to me. And I'm not 100% sure who uh, they collaborated with on this. Wait, I could actually quickly double check that right now. So, Hytale. So, if I go down to their web site, Hytale.com. So basically, embark on a journey of adventure and creativity. The scope of a sandbox with the depth of a role-playing game. Immersing players in a procedurally generated world where teetering towers and deep dungeons promise rich rewards. I'm, I'm watching the trailer right now. High Pixel Studios. High Telf FAQ. When is it coming out? Still to be confirmed. Three main pillars. Adventure minigames creative. So minigames, yeah, so it's kind of like... Yeah, basically a lot, like a lot of servers out there. Uh, this is like the minecart equivalents. Ooh. The mini temples. Oh, and there's a lot of these mobs as well. So that's nice. I mean, I mean, it looks very original if you ask me. The concept for Minecraft, but then the ideas of the game itself, the aspects, the features, and that. Hold up a second. Community servers. This is. Wait, this is just the high pixel lobby recreated, and isn't it? I mean, I, I don't go to the main lobby often, but, I'm, but I swear this is what it looks like. So, we go running around, enter the portal. Yeah, this is definitely Hypixel. Like, this, this is the Skywars map. I don't know the name, surprisingly. I don't know why. <laughs> but, like, this is definitely looks like Skywars. And then you see the book. Mini games. Yeah. Oh, that's kind of like Hunger Games. This is what... I don't know what this is. Oh, this, that's like Battle Royale. A battle royale game inside the hmm. extensive modding. Ooh, guns, powerful tools. Oh wow, this is pretty nice. Run, walk. I mean, this is just a lot of game work code and stuff, so wouldn't be surprised. Animating, epic adventures. Be yourself. Also, this is custom. Oh wow, watch videos together. Like you see, this is probably gonna be really good. I mean, we can like casually watch those Vimeo memes or YouTube dank memes together inside. I mean, if they, if they add something like those voice talk, I think it'll be really, really nice like that. So it's like a mini movie theater, so which I, it's a good idea. Paint the world, make, mo make movies. Oh, so this is, in this, in a way, it's like, it's kind of like replay mod, so you could see what's going on and make cinematic cuts. Live scripting, oh my, oh wow. And then you have to fight the mobs. Ooh. High tail. Might as well leave a like on this. Oh. If you ask me, like, this looks pretty good. Uh, I'm actually an honest game. Looks so beautiful. Can't wait for it. I love Hytale. A lot of comments. So, up platform. This will be on PC and Mac. And capacity to run game servers on Linux. Wouldn't be surprised. Languages, probably English first. Can you reserve my username? Only one Bob, one Sally. Watch age rating T14. That's fine with me. Pair controls, free to play. Of the business model, mm, it's probably gonna be something like Hypixel. I mean, they they do they did say on the Twitter that they do have the funding for all of this, but then of course they're still gonna have to like continue and continue. And Hypixel Inc is the company that runs and will continue to run the Hypixel server, of course. And Hypixel Studios is a new company that has been formed to develop Hytale. And there's on tw oh Twitter, yeah Twitter I already have them. There's Instagram I can always see. Hmm. Hytale game. Alright, I have to log in first. I'm not going to do that now. Tell us more about PvP, touch lightly. Proper custom built engine. Oh, wow. So, that, so if you ask me, this is a really huge props to the Hypixel Inc. and Hypixel Studios. Like, they're pretty... Well, they were seen before. So, huge props to those guys who decided to make this. And I'm really interested to see what else they're going to add. And probably the future of the game. If you ask me for me, I'll probably be playing it. Most likely, I would say 90% that I will. So, I think it's a really good effort for what they've done from starting off from a Minecraft server, and they're trying to become the next, the next new game, probably the next, the next Fortnite in a way. 
Well, not exactly Fortnite. Fortnite is controversial, but then, yeah, I I like I like what it's seeing right now. The concepts of Minecraft are there with its own features and specialness, and I think a lot, maybe a lot of people in the community might come back to play this, so we can all reunite as a community, like the Minecraft community once was, like with things like UHC, uh, like the meetups, uh, our PVP like Arcane, Bad Lion. Yeah, and you get the idea, and it run my own server down run your own adventure service or mini games ooh mod the game can I use high tail announcement assets permission to activate well I'm not monetized anyway so I wouldn't really see a point and we're able to monetize any high tail content you'll be able to make your content yeah so nothing too much on the bottom welcome to hypix yeah the user interface so let's take a look so adventure my avatar so you can customize this really well. I'll probably make something that looks like me in a way. Might be a challenge. Character creator. Find dungeons. A lot of missions. So, hmm. so it's kind of like a what's it called? MMORPG adventure fusion. So yeah. Well, that's all I have to say, guys. So uh, thank you guys for watching this this uh, uncut video, and I hope you guys enjoy my opinions and thoughts on this. And I'll see you guys next time.